All right, today we're going to pack two boxes. Same contents, two different packing materials. Packing material number one will be packing peanuts. And away we go. We bought a bag of packing peanuts at Staples. It's one cubic feet of packing peanuts and the cost was approximately eight dollars for the bag. And we've used about uh, 80 percent of the bag on this particular box and we have considerable cleanup that we need to do because of the packing peanuts being spilled onto the work surface floor and it's taken us extra time just get to get to the point where we cleaned up our work area All right, now we're going to pack the box again using the We Air air cushions. And while we were uh, setting up our box, we have run about 15 feet of uh, We Air air cushions. And we're now going to repack the box using uh, We Air air cushions. And the air cushions we ran are the maximum size which are approximately 11 inches in length and uh, 8 inches by width. So what we've done is uh, used three or four air cushions at a time tearing off the perforation uh, until the box is securely packed with air cushions. And that completes the process. Uh, very clean, uh, no cleanup uh, as we saw with using the packing peanuts. Now that we've completed uh, packing the box using air cushions, uh, the material cost comparison is using packing peanuts that we purchased from Staples. Uh, the material consumed to pack this box was about six dollars and forty cents. When we calculate using 13 feet of We Air cushions, uh, the material cost is about a dollar nineteen to pack the box. So six dollars and forty cents of packing material as compared to a dollar nineteen.